All right, so it looks like I can do some tricks here to divide. I could use polynomial division, but I'm going to try something out here. So I can, I can rewrite this. So I can factor out an x squared term, and I get x plus 3, and then minus 4 quantity x minus 3. I'm working with a numerator here, and then in the denominator I can do an x plus 3, x minus 2. So then on top, oh, sorry, this should be an x plus 3 because I factor out a minus, a minus sign. So, all right, so further, so this becomes x plus 3, and then quantity x squared minus 4. I'm still working with a numerator. And this x squared minus 4 can actually become x plus 2, x minus 2, over, and then our x plus 3, x minus 2. x minus 2 just cancel out. And we're left simply with x plus 2. And that's what we get for b. Now, you could have used polynomial division. You would have ended up with x plus 2. It's up to you, but I just saw this and I decided to do it this way. So I hope that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.